So you, are you fit and 100% ready to start now? Uh, I'm fit. I already played 45 last game and uh, I feel good now and uh, I'm ready to help the team. How difficult is it to come on at half time in the situation where your team are trailing by three goals to nil? Of course, it's not the most comfortable situation, but uh, you not always get thrown in uh, when it's nice. You also need to help your teammates when it's not going good. That's all about team. If it's not going good, this is the uh, time to show up. Did you feel the mood has been affected by that result last Wednesday? Of course, there were not a lot of happy faces afterwards. Uh, nobody expect this because everybody know what happened there and uh, everybody was really criticizing himself and uh, was not um, happy about their performance. And uh, yeah, we are working on this. To the emphasis on defending the last few days in training? Yeah, there was a big focus on defending because uh, this is the uh, biggest thing to get um, successful. I think this is the first step, uh, defend good. Ian Kennedy. Charles, um, in terms of the, the defending, we've heard a lot about what the manager has been saying since the Napoli game, but is it almost a case of trying to go back to the basics and trying to remember what, what you were doing well for, for such a long time? I think it always helps if you go back to the roots and uh, these are successful roots and if you're based on this and this can give you a help for a struggling time. And there are a lot of experienced players Of course, we, we need to lead, we need to talk with each other and need to help each other. That's only, you cannot go uh, as a person out of this, only as a team. And uh, for this you need your teammates and you need to help your teammates. And uh, if you're older and experienced, uh, you should do it. Andy Hunter. don't want to take any excuses. We, uh, we play at Liverpool and we want to play as much games as possible and uh, it's not always comfortable this amount of games, especially for the international players uh, with all the games they play, but uh, um, I think uh, we just try to perform and uh, we want to play as much games as possible. That's why we are here. Any more? At the back, Carl. Hey. I think uh, in the team we are uh, quite clear. Uh, sometimes it hurts, and this is normal. But uh, as a good team, what we, what I think we are, uh, you can speak out this truth. Uh, you die, you don't like to hear them maybe in the first moment sometimes, but uh, you know everybody knows that uh, something has to uh, happen and uh, that we have to improve and that we have to work on uh, these kind of things. And uh, for these kind of things, we have uh, to talk. Chris Baskin. I think it's not easy to give like this one thing, then it would be easy and everybody would laughing, okay, this one thing and everybody turned around. I think a lot of things can help us. It starts with defending and uh, playing the way we played always, but uh, it's not easy to say this is a thing, uh, if we change it, everything will go well. And But uh, we need to expect Ajax is a great side and uh, that we have to suffer there also. And uh, it doesn't will go directly from first second, but we want to be there from the first second and want to fight there. And I think this is the only way to get back on, on the way, on the trip. Dominic? Everybody knows him. I think he's quite uh, motivated most of the time. Uh, it's like uh, it's a different situation, but uh, I think uh, there was never be a motivation lack with him. So he was always at on his toes and always want to be the best. Even when we played good, he uh, the day after training he was also asking for everything and a lot. And uh, different situation. We didn't play good, and uh, but uh, yeah, 
he's uh, still there and the one uh, make us the best team we can be. Well done. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.